Hello, guys. It's OPS Gamer here, and today I am making or doing a trade. Um, the rules will be in the description, and I will separate the ones of the ones that need good offers or the ones that need like um, Pacific Pets for them. Um, I will also put out a wish list of the pets that will be rare and I need those pets off my wish list uh, for them um, so yeah let's get started with the trade um, this one is not for trade um, so yeah let's put her aside um, the first one we have up for trade will be uh, this armadillo um, she's number one um, I she's really dirty and um, but I can wash her, um, all the pets will be washed, um, but she has a hole, and, uh, yeah, so pet number one, and these, I don't care what type of offers I get for them, I don't really care, just some okay offers, or anything, really, um, we have this lion, uh, he has a chipped nose. You can't really see because the light kind of doesn't show. Um, yeah, but he has a chip on his nose. And, um, he's actually pretty clean. And he has a hole. And, uh, he just has a little dirt up here. He's number two on the list. Okay. Pet number three will be this, hold on, this, uh, Corky or Corgi or Corky or something, whatever it's called. Um, she's on <laughs> number three. Um, she's in really good condition, I shall say. She's actually in better condition than most of my pets for trade. Um, so, yeah. Number four will be this Kali. Um, yeah, I don't really care what type of offers I get for him, really. It's just that uh, uh, I don't really <laughs> like this Kali at all. Um, so he's in great condition. Um, so number four. Number five will be this Bulldog. Um, she has quite a lot of marks of marker and crayon and just colored pencils and stuff. Um, yeah, so she has a hole and there's also an L. Well, it's supposed to be a T, but it's an L um, <laughs> on her. So she's number five. Number six will be this boxer. Um, he's, a, he's really dirty. His head is kind of really loose. Um, his ear is kind of ripped. Um, his tail's chipped. Um, his nose is chipped. He has, like, really bad condition. Like, his head is very really loose. But he has a magnet. And, uh, yeah. So he's pet number six on the list. Um, pet number seven will be this two-colored horse. Um, she has a little chip of paint there. Um, she has a chip on her hooves, and she has, like, makeup or something in between. Uh, whatever that is. Um... So, yeah, so she has, like, a chip or whatever stuff is right there. Um, she is pet number seven. Pet number eight will be this cat. Um, this pop cat. He, I got him like this. His eyes was like this when I got him. And, uh, his face and stuff is kind of uh, scratched up and things um but he's pet number eight pet number nine will be this pig um this pig 
isn't in the greatest condition either. He kind of has marker and colored pencil, just like the rest. Um, but uh, he has a hole. Oh, and he has a magnet. If you guys didn't know that, he had a magnet. Um, but he has a hole. He's really dirty. And uh, yeah, so he's dirty. Uh, pet number ten will be this uh, ant eater. Um, again, with, I don't know what this red stuff is on the pets, um, but some of the pets, like, he has it, um, so does the bulldog, they have, like, some red stuff, and she has a hole, and she's really dirty, and, but, she's pet number 10, pet number 11 will be this chow, or chihuahua, and she, again, isn't in the greatest condition either. Her eye makeup and stuff is damaged. And uh, she has a magnet. And yeah, so this is this pet, Eleven. Uh, number 12 will be um, this, uh, whatever, Chow Chow, or whatever it's called. Um, he isn't in the greatest condition either. He's in quite bad condition. He has glitter on his eyes, and he has a magnet, and the bottom has two L's, or T's, or whatever that is, and uh, he has makeup and stuff in his eyes. So, pet number 12. Pet number 13 will be this horse. She has a lot of glitter. Um, yeah, so she has a lot of glitter and stuff, and I tried taking it off. And that kind of happened, and her eyes messed up, and, uh, she, yeah, I don't really have much to say about this one. She's all still rusted on her neck, but she's pet number 13. Pet number 14 will be this squirrel. Uh, she has a hole. Um, pet number 14 is this guy. Uh, so, yeah. Not much to say. She's actually in pretty good condition. Uh, pet number 15 will be this bear. Polar bear. Um, chipped nose. She has a hole. She's a mark right there. A mark. Like right there. Um, and uh, she's pretty good condition. It's not as dirty as the other ones. Pet number 17 will be this, um, lizard. It's actually really detailed, and it feels really cool when you touch it. Um, she's pretty cool, actually. I, I love this one. So, I'm gonna have to have, like, maybe a kitten or something for this one, just because it's, uh, really good LPS stuff, because it's textured, and not a lot of textured LPS are out there, so... Pet number 18 will be this white bunny, um, again, with the marker thing, uh, he's dirty too, he's really dirty, um, but that's pet number 18. These are all the ones that I need okay offers for, or good offers for, um, yeah, so we're gonna go on to the extreme rare OPS, and I need really, really good offers for. Um, so yeah, hold on. Okay, so the first one we have up for a really, really good offer is this pink dash hound or dachshund, um, or dash hound. I don't know how do you pronounce this one. Um, she has a hole. And she's not in the greatest condition either. She's kind of in okay condition. Uh, she's really dirty. Again, these OPS will be scrubbed and cleaned and washed. But uh, pet number one for the really, really good offers. Pet number two will be this poodle. Um, she did come in the mommy and baby set. I don't have the baby. I don't know what happened to the baby. <laughs> um... 
She has a chipped nose. Marker right here. Marks right there. Uh, kind of marker and stuff like that. Um, she has a hole. And, uh, she's in okay dick condition. Pet number three will be this golden retriever. He's in really bad condition. He doesn't have a tail. He has a lot of red stuff. He's a, a magnet. Uh, his eyes are all whatever jacked up. Um, but, uh, yeah, he has all these marks and stuff. So, uh, he's pet number three. Pet number four will be this greyhound. Uh, she falls over a lot. So, um, and she also has a rusted neck. But she is in pretty good condition, I shall say. She's not in the greatest, but she's not in the worst either. Um, she's, like, really clean compared to the other ones. Um, and she's number four on the list. And she has three magnets. Uh, number five will be this husky. Um, he's in actually really good condition. Um, he just has nail polish right here, a chipped nose, and that's really it. And his tail's kind of jacked up at the top. But other than that, he's in pretty good condition. And, uh, he just has this, like, red mark right there. But, he, uh, he's in really good condition. So he's pet number five. Pet number six will be this Dalmatian. Um... She's in really good condition. Her eye, though, on the other hand, there's, like, red in the crevice. I don't know if I could get that off. And she has a couple of marks. And you guys can I don't know if you guys can see. But there is pink marker on her cheek. And other than that, in the top of her head. Um, and she has really chipped paws. Other than that, she's in pretty good condition. Um... But she's, I guess you could say, in okay condition, since it's not the greatest condition either. Um, so she's pet number six, since you can't see her because she's out of view. Pet number seven will be this Persian. Um, this Persian is in really good condition. Um, she's really clean. She just has black there and a couple of stuff on her cheek. Uh, she's in pretty good condition, honestly. Um, she's a hole. So she's pet number seven. Pet number eight will be this deer. Um, this deer is actually in pretty good condition. Or, <laughs> never mind, it's in okay condition. It's not in the greatest either. She's really dirty. And she has a lot of marks and stuff. So she's in okay condition. Um, she's not in the greatest. Um, she could do a lot of more cleaning up with, and she has a hole, and you can't see it, but she has a hole. Um, and she's really good, so, yeah. Number nine will be, and this pet will be cleaned if you want it cleaned. Um, it's the old Angelina. I will, this actually comes off with water. And I will get this off for whoever wants it off. Um, it This stuff will come off. And I'll show her when she's done getting cleaned and stuff like that. But she is the Angelina with no fur. I took off all the fur. And I painted her. But then I realized I took off the paint. And uh, she's really good when you take off the paint and stuff. So she... When she's done, I will post a video about her, and yeah, but she's pet number nine. She is okay. Pet number ten will be Rachel Rivera, also known as this Cocker Spaniel. Um, she, I don't, I want another Cocker Spaniel for her. Um, there's a specific Cocker Spaniel I want for her because... Uh, yeah, she's in really good condition, too. Um, when I got her, she used to be, like, my favorite LPS, and, um, now I just, I don't know, she's not my favorite now, 
but she is in great condition, like, really, really good condition, like, excellent. <laughs> so, yeah, she's pet number 10. Uh, pet number 11 will be this short hair. He's in pretty good condition, and um, he will be in my series that is coming up. But if somebody wants him, I can take him out the series, and um, or I can make him die or something in the series because he's getting traded. Um, but he's in pretty good condition. Um, just the lettering on the bottom of his foot and his eye um, isn't the greatest. Um, but we have him for pet number 12, I think. Pet number 13 will be, and I need a really extremely good offer, um, this sitting down cat. Um, the reason I need a really good offer for her is because she is actually really rare. I don't see a lot of this pet anywhere, and I've actually seen that she's probably really the rarest I have at the moment. She's not a lot of people have her, or maybe people just don't show her in videos, but she's really rare, and she's pretty cool. So, yeah. Pet number 13. That should be. Pet number 14 will be this uh, beagle. Straight off hand, you can tell that she's really dirty. Um, her ear was glued from the previous owner, and her ear is glued exactly like on this side, so it's like stuck to her head. And, uh,. She has a blue magnet. She also has, like, I guess an Illuminati triangle on the bottom. Um, but she's in terrible condition. Um, but offers would be really good for her. Or just, she will be clean, too. Pet number, I think, 15 is this cat. Which is a dream cat, I think what it's called. Um, her eye is jacked up. And, um, other than that, she's in really good condition. She's just really dirty and needs some more fixing up to do. Other than that, she's in good condition, like I said. Um, good offers for her, please. Good offers would be great. Okay, now the three pets that are coming up are going to be for extremely good offers. Like, I need extremely good offers. So I'll get rid of all of these guys. Again, extremely good offers for these. The first one we have up is this Dalmatian. Dalmatian. Um, I meant Dash Hound. I'm sorry. Um, this is makeup, but I can get it off for whoever wants it off. Um, yeah, she's in really good condition. She's just really dirty, and she just has makeup and stuff. Other than that, she's in really, really good condition. And I need extreme offers for her. Um, pet number two, which is this guy. And I'm afraid to put him up because I want I need, I need another Sage Bond. Um, because I don't want to get rid of this one. But I really need some new OPS and I need a good offer for him. Even though his uh, ear has been chewed off, I need an extremely good offer. He is in really good condition. I need a really good offer for him. Um, yeah. But, yeah. He's in really good condition. Just his ears fucked up. And other than that, um, Eve's in really good condition. Extremely good offer for him, please. The last pet, he needs an extreme offer too, because he is another Kali. Um, he is in good condition. Uh, he just has makeup on him. He's in actually pretty good condition, as I noticed. He's in <laughs> really, really good condition. For him, I would like to get Sage Bond. And I will trade him for another Kali or one of my wish list pets that I really, really want. Um, because 
I really want sage for him because he. I want the sage uh, with an ear, please. <laughs> um, but yeah, that is all for trade. Again, for the last three, I need extremely good offers off my wish list, and um, maybe for sage, I'll take or for the dash out, I might take another brook because or this cat for this one. Um, because I really <laughs> love Brooke, and this one has, like, uh, messed up stuff. So, it would be nice if you guys would like to trade. Um, thank you for watching and watching this trade. Sorry the video is, like, 20 minutes long, but it's a really rare trade, and it, I need to trade, so... Uh, yeah, if you guys want to trade, please comment down below or go to my social media. That will be at the end of this video. And, yeah. Thanks, guys. Have a nice uh, trade. Good offers, please. And, bye.